Ben Affleck, 50, and Jennifer Lopez, 53, became one of the Naughty's most iconic couples after they got engaged in 2002, earning the joint nickname Benifer. However, the pair were forced to break up their engagement a year later due to the excessive media attention but reconnected in 2021 after the singers split from Alex Rodriguez. The couple eventually exchanged vows last year in a super small wedding in Las Vegas, Nevada. Now, Affleck has gushed over his superhuman other half's ability to remain youthful thanks to her work ethic. Affleck said, she works out. I mean, I work out too. But I don't magically appear to be 20 years old. Sir Roger Moore seen in final video three days before he died leaving son choked up the work ethic is real, the discipline is very real, but also the superhuman thing is real, the deep water actor added in a recent appearance on the Drew Barrymore show. Affleck also labeled the on-the-floor singer the most gorgeous woman in the world, causing the host and Charlie's Angels actress to collapse on her chair. Asked by her guest whether she was falling asleep, Barrymore responded, No, I'm swooning, adding that she was just living vicariously through romance and men appreciating women. Lopez has also previously expressed her appreciation for her partner, as she opened up about the pain surrounding the initial breakup, revealing, I honestly felt like I was going to die. Looking back at her up-and-down relationship with Affleck, the pop icon recalled the heartbreak of calling off their initial wedding nearly two decades ago. Don't miss. Sire Khan details how loose women bosses made it clear time was up, latest, Bobby Davro breaks silence on tragedy as new fiancé battles cancer, health, Carol Vorderman dubbed a true beauty wearing tight leather, style. Speaking with Zane Lowe in an Apple Music interview published late last year, Lopez admitted how painful it was to go through the breakup. It was so painful after we broke up, she explained to Lowe, as she went on to recall the emotional separation. The actress revealed, it sent me on a spiral for the next 18 years where I just couldn't get it right. But now, 20 years later, it does have a happy ending. It has the most would never happen in Hollywood ending, she added. Jennifer and Ben first met in 2001 on the set of their famous box office flop Julie. At the time, Jennifer was married to Chris Judd, her second husband whom she met on the set of her music video for Love Don't Cost a Thing and Wed in September 2001.